Hello, Paxi. And hello, everyone on Earth. My name is Colonel Mike Hopkins, and I am an astronaut on board the International Space Station. Paxi, are you picking up any radio signals on your antenna? On Earth, you may have used radio signals to watch television or listen to music. A mobile phone uses radio to make and receive calls. Even Wi-Fi and Bluetooth are forms of radio. Up here on the International Space Station, we are 400 kilometers above the Earth and traveling at over seven kilometers per second. We go once around the Earth every 92 minutes. That makes it quite hard to have a cable going all the way down to the ground. So we have to use radio to talk to people back on Earth. This is, in fact, part of our normal routine up here. This is one of the radios we use on board the International Space Station. When I press this button, I can transmit my voice to the ground using radio. It's like a walkie-talkie. The microphone picks up the sound waves from my voice, then the radio converts them into electromagnetic waves which carry within them the original sound waves. This is where the phrase carrier waves come from. The radio then emits the electromagnetic carrier waves through an antenna on the outside of the space station. And those waves travel down through the atmosphere at the speed of light to other people's antennas on the ground. Their radios then convert the received electromagnetic waves back into the original sound waves and they hear my voice coming out of their speakers. Let's give it a try. Hello, this is the International Space Station and is, is anyone down there? When I release the button, my radio will listen for their electromagnetic carrier waves coming up from the ground. When the antenna here picks up those waves, my radio converts them back into sound waves and I can hear their voice through this speaker. I've spoken to a lot of different people from the International Space Station using radio. Sometimes it's famous people, sometimes it's people just at home with the radio. Though a lot of times it's teachers and students. School kids always ask the best questions. We always try to give individual personal answers. But my favorite question I ever had was, if I could bring any animal to space, what would it be? Oh, do you want to know the answer? Well. I'd like to bring a bird to the International Space Station because I'd like to see how it flies in microgravity. Oh, I can hear a school right now. Do you want to talk to them, Paxi? If you're interested in talking to us yourself, you can find out more at the end of the video. See you next time.